Yasin Chumi that just a moment ago still searching for their first Valley win of the season. The 61st all-time matchup between these two programs is underway as the Braves control. Dean finds Leons. He was hot last game and stays that way. And an answer on the right side by Gage Bogue. And the Braves quickly back the other way. Leons will answer. That's an early on three-point contest. We see two threes from Malibu. They, they got mass feed mass, underneath. but yeah. great anticipation by Coleman. He takes it away. He that that's a team leading 21st steal for Coleman. Left corner three is off. It's early on. See Connor Hickman the three ball, knocking it down. Beat the rebounds per game and see him an aggressive take to the hoop. High volume shooter, and he gets on the board here tonight. Mass backing his way in, and good touch by the big man underneath. Yeah, beautiful left hand hook shot from Rink Mass, just asserting his dominance as well on this side of the floor too to create some turnovers. You see a nice three pointer there from Coleman. He's one of their keys, absolutely. Ambitious is to me. Henry the other way with the slam. You can't stop Deshaun Henry. Two free throws upcoming for Evans. For Evansville, just seven scholarship players dressed once again, staying close early on. Uh, Strawbridge. So Hickman. Again, the Braves searching for 17. Bounce pass in traffic to Smith. Juggles it and lays it in. Nicely done. Beautiful pass from Bo. He's pivot. And he gets one at oh, from both Henry and Hannah, and they both have a slam so far tonight. And the to Weathers looking for his first three of the year, and he's got it. Yeah, just like they drew it up, right? Get a post touch to Randall. Unable to get it to go, and Bradley with a little bit of momentum here now. Montgomery, the mid range jumper. You haven't picked one up in the valley this season. A heartbreaker. You see Toomey, the strong community. On the wing, Leon's up top, Tavaninen. Lands, who had the first six for the Braves. Finds Dean contested three, doesn't matter. Yeah, really nice pass to it. First trip to the line tonight for Mast, an 82% foul for Teleconference. Brian Wardle said, you know, this team still has some levels that it can continue to get improve on. And he said, Brian. Mast to Hickman, who knocks down a three. Really, really. Six with it's good. Yeah, Bradley just got some cooking on the offensive end. The out to bar, they've. Well, he clips that percentage in a small sample. At Carver Arena, and, and you shoot seven of eight from behind the arc, I mean, it's going to be trouble, trouble, trouble for your opponent. And, you know, Evansville did stick in the game here early on, but you got to give Bradley. And this 1-3-1 one, one defense has been cost oh, havoc. Oh, what a find <laughs> underneath for Smith. Yeah, and that's exactly. One, kind of that foundation being built and how they can transition that moving forward. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. You see his offense. Still sort of known for um said they definitely would be keep wearing it had they won that game on yeah. saturday but bring those back you see a nice pass hickman rink mass going down the lane and they do offensively in the corner here's leons high post to mass back to hickman and another three yeah, good nice backdoor back cut. cut zipped in the corner now in the wing bogue for a second triple that's down that's exactly shot what by they Gage needed bogue. no without a doubt brian from beyond the elbow, knocks down another. You mentioned he called him silky earlier. That's Absolutely. 16 against ISU. And just like it, just when it looked like Bradley was going to start to pull away a little bit, I had a 17 point advantage. Evansville, a nice 4 0 run. And they're going to get a, some momentum going right here. Looks like Gage Bow maybe rolled an ankle a little bit, Ginger, on the far side. But nonetheless, Evansville, another opportunity to chip into this Bradley lead. Bogue the senior, right side Coleman. They got the high low here too. Yep. Weathers down low and great help side defense. They're gonna that they've excelled at not only this year but in, in previous years as well. You see a nice play right there, Darius. What do they do? They give him the ball coming off the screen. The defense expects him to be the one shooting, and they throw it up instead. The three point action. He comes up short. Leon's keeps it alive. Goes reverse and scores. Driving in, kick, Tavanainen, three, good. Beautiful offense by Bradley. 
spins middle and makes it look three point line early and they really carried it throughout that first half. Yeah, it really was a three point barrage. You see Evansville got involved with it too as well, but Bradley started out the game seven of eight from behind the three point arc. Now since then they've cooled down a little bit, just two for seven or two for uh, nine rather. And so kind of regressed to the mean a little bit. Evansville had a couple really nice runs to get back in it. We saw Darius hand Low block, looking for Mast, and said Leons goes baseline. Look at that length, and he's so good at that eye. Part of it, but also just extra shots, extra for possessions. Sure. The Braves have done a great job taking care of the basketball, just three first half turnovers. And let's see a little hip check here on the drive. Pick and roll to Mast. And I don't think he will save away. Low block, Strawbridge looking to use that size to his advantage, and Leons right at the hole. around or keep going the way that they're going? Great touch by that right there, the fall away jumper from Mast. Uh-oh, here's a chance for Henry. Here comes a flush. There, Brian, throw, throw it right into the backcourt. Nobody even goes to the ball. Deshaun Henry says, hey, I know what to do with that. Takes it the other end, throws it down with two. Right side of the lane for Smith and a whistle and a foul. And there's Dean. There's Hannah. There's oh! the slam. No doubting is it. Uh oh. 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 They can't stop him. Strawbridge the other way fades and gets it to go. Good answer on the high arcing shot by getting back involved, sticking with it. And he, the resilience. I try again and third time's a charm, right, Brian? Absolutely, and then off the live. Third chance, and this time it's good. You talk about efficiency, Darius Hannes, four for four with this game. Bradley's leading three-point shooter, 50% from behind the yard. Montgomery, there's a three. You mentioned his team leading numbers they'd put up as Dean finger rolls one off the glass. And yeah, Brian, you're uh -oh, talking about. Oh, here's oh. Hannah again. This time, this lays it in. Dean. Connects on a three. Yeah, and just everything is on display again tonight. Mass trying to get to the three-point party. Connor Hickman the steal and a quick foul from Evansville. From probably, what, a, even a month ago? Right. This is a possibility, and now he's seeing action, and he's got one, and he's looking for Tavanine and sets the screen for him. Back to Jonovic, who lays it off the glass. And Phillips thinks about a three, glides in, goes up, scores, and the foul. Just a little bit easty here. Illinois State has gone on top of Missouri State. That too, and that's one of those metrics that you kind of look at. Also the... Oh, oh how about that? The There's the baby hook. Silk. You know, probably the highest it's been in almost a decade, I'm sure. They're really, really high. In As Weathers gets a step and flips it up and in. Awesome explosiveness right there for, for the three-pointer, but Bradley's defense has been absolutely stifling. You see right there, as that's coming up. You got two of them coming up back to back, but it all starts coming up Saturday in Des Moines. Another dominating home performance in 17 games. Now tied for seventh in the country.